What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Rahel and today I have a new video for you guys. In today's video, we're actually not going to talk about jeans as per usual. Today is actually about coats because have y'all seen this weather? It's getting cold, it's getting wet, it's getting just... I just want to be in my house right now. Like It's winter time so that means staying cozy in bed or having the perfect coat. <laughs> if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Um, here you can expect curvy fashion, beauty or hair. Right now I'm focusing on fashion more so, but we're gonna tap into that fashion and beauty um, section soon. So don't forget to click that notification bell to always be aware of my newest, latest videos. Let's start. Let's start with this Shein long full fur teddy coat. Um, I got this this coat last year in winter. Um, Shein had like a huge sale going on, so I coped that, and I really loved it. And it's actually still trendy, so. Ooh, and fluffy. Oh, let me make sure my hands in, in ashy because that's <laughs> that's what always happens. My hands be ashy. My hands are ashy as soon as I actually all the time, 24/7. So I, I don't know if you guys know she is. It's a very affordable brand, and this coat was I think 40, 40 to 50 bucks. I think this looks way better than 40 bucks. You know. The only thing though, after the second or third time wearing this, the buttons, which were here, you can still see the one part of the buttons, but there's nothing here. Um, third time wearing it, and the buttons literally disappeared. Got popped off. Actually, I'm lying. <laughs> Wait, look. I think this is the other part. Yeah. So, Sheen's quality is not the best, but... It definitely looks stylish and beautiful. Like this coat is one of my favorites and it keeps me very warm. So if you're looking for a cheap, affordable coat which looks super nice, feels nice and keeps you warm, but May doesn't have the best quality, she is the way to go. The second coat is from Doll Skill. They reached out to me last year around winter time, so and they asked me if I wanted to get something gifted and I was like perfect because I need a new coat, so what's up? I actually love this coat. It's in a size small. It's considered a full, full fur coat. And has this really cool pattern. I would say it's like a medium length. It's like not too long. It's not too short. It's actually the perfect length for me. I'm 5'4", so if you 5'4", this length is a good length for you. It's always a conversation starter. Like, whenever I walk around, People come up to me and just tell me how much they like this coat and where I got it from. It's from Doll Skills. I, I checked the, the website online to see if they have something similar right now. And unfortunately they don't um, have like the red and black, but they have different kinds. They're very like, very unique in their ways. So what I like the most about this coat is you can literally wear like an all black outfit and then throw this jacket on and boom, you have like a whole, like it's a whole look. <laughs> Um, you can basically hang, okay, you can close it, that's it, that's all we need to know. There's two hangers, and you can close the coat that way, and it keeps, it keeps me very warm too, so that's good in the winter time, especially here in New York City, you gotta stay warm. I think they retail it for $100, but they always have some sales going on, so definitely check out their website for more. Two of the coats of this year's collections uh, from two stores, Primark and N. Taylor, and we start with Primark. If you guys don't know Primark, I did a video about their jeans, which is this video right here. If you go and check it out, uh, one thing about Primark is that they you cannot and you can literally not on. Um, shop anything online so you would really have to go into one of the stores and 
check out their clothing there. I'm gonna let the, I'm gonna link their website below so you can see where the closest Primark is from you. This coat is one of my favorites. It's also a plate pattern, but it has like this beige gray vibe to it with these really pretty buttons. Like, um, let me show you guys. Like, come on, guys, isn't this so pretty? And it's super long, like it's literally so long. Like I'm 5'4 and it almost touches the floor when I wear it. But it's a vibe, you know, it's a whole vibe. This code I got in uh, US 6, which is an European 38. And I believe this was 45 or $42. It's not the warmest code. Uh, it's super long. Actually, let me get my chair. Y'all know the vibe. I see it's so long. <laughs> Where? I love to wear this with uh, jeans and a uh, turtleneck or something. I really like it when it's closed, like when I button it up. There's like a loose hanging off the shoulders, like this. If I wear a good turtleneck underneath this this coat, I'm definitely warm. But if it's under below seven degrees Celsius. I really don't consider I really don't consider wearing this. And now we are coming to the beauty. I mean do y'all see this though? This is my second primer coat. And I believe this is also just like $40. But let me show you guys how beautiful this coat is like. So I got this coat like I guess a month ago and it's an all black faux fur coat. So this coat is a small size small and I think it's, it was also like around $50. And I really needed a, a classic like elegant coat to just literally throw one like this. And I went to Primark and I was just like, really though? I would also say this is a mid-length coat. Keeps me warm. It gives me an elegant look. Like I, I like to actually throw my coats on like this. This looks like you spent a whole lot of coin, but meanwhile you only spent forty dollars. Honestly, don't walk. Run. Run to Primark. Literally, because you can't on, um, shop online. <laughs> Now we get into the Ann Taylor coats I got. This trench coat, y'all, became immediately one of my favorites. It's a, they say it's a vegan leather coat. Vegan just means it's not real. So this is just fake leather. It's an, uh, I thought it was black, but it's actually a dark blue and I got this one in a medium because it's just really fitting. So I just wanted to make sure it fits well and I can layer up underneath. Um, so let me just show you how this pretty looks. Yeah. Hold one. Hold one. Give me a second, bro. Hold one. And. like a bum underneath this and you wear this trench coat and all of a sudden you have a whole look and now we're coming to my last coat and my favorite this is the Ann Taylor fluffiest coat ever <laughs> I think it's also full fur I got it in a size small because I think it's supposed to be oversized so I got it in a small to make sure I don't look like a potato because I'm 5'4 and if I wear coats that are oversized too oversized, I just look like a potato, so I can't. So I did this, I got it in a small, and I think this fits pretty well. 
and I still have enough space to just layer up underneath and y'all isn't this the cutest little coat like this high color just gives me life like I I sometimes just wear it even without a scarf or a turtleneck and I always need to keep my neck warm but this color just does it for me like what you know what I mean? It's also like a medium length coat, I would say. Yeah. It's super fluffy and it's so comfy and so warm and cozy. I almost feel like I'm wearing a blanket outside. Super cute. Super cute and very elegant too. I do also wear it as a throw over, you know. Owen. You know coming out of your uber like excuse me so you guys i showed you my favorite coats for this year's winter um comment down below which coat was your favorite um mine definitely was the last one from ann taylor but i would love to know like have you ever shopped also at primark because primark is the goat like literally you definitely have to do that for yourself <laughs> um and also let me know what kind of content you would like to see here i'm definitely going to do more fashion more different fashion not just jeans but we're definitely going to keep on looking for the perfect jeans don't don't worry about that we're still going to do that and i'm one to do some some stuff with my hair i think i'm going to color it soon um my birthday is coming up i'm sad okay, thank you so much for watching and i will see you very very soon